Let's play study. How many factors over 12? Oh, easy. Okay, factor. That's right. So, 1. I'm going to write all those factors, okay? So, 1, 2, what about 3? That's right. Divided by 3 is possible. What about 4? 5, no. What about 6? That's right. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Oh, 12. That's right. That means totally how many? Six of them. That's right. So we have six factors of 12. Okay, wait a minute. Any shortcut or trick? Oh, that's right. I have a trick. Okay, let's talk about that one. I'm going to write 12. Then change this one to prime factor. Okay, I'm going to do prime factor. That means you have to use all prime numbers. Okay? That means just like this. Okay, maybe 12. Divide by what is the smallest prime number? Prime number? Oh, 1 is not. So 2. That's right. Let's use 2. That's possible. 6. One more time. 2. Then divide by 2, which is 3. So 2, 2, 3. Oh, that's right. So I can write this one like it. 2 to the second power. Because 2 times 2 times 3. 3 is by itself. That's why actually 1. Okay. That's exponent. Now watch carefully. So that's exponent right there. Exponent right there. But you got to add 1 each right there. Okay. So plus 1 plus 1. That means this is going to be 3. So 3 times this is 2. Oh, so 2 times 3, which is 6. That's why 6 factors right there. Wow, so easy. Okay, uh, this time let's try 72. How about that? Oh, man, must be many, many. Okay, so now 72, oh, I cannot count. Okay, so let me use that technique, trick, whatever. Okay, 72, you must change this one to what? That's right, prime factor shape. So then 72, divided by smallest possible, okay? Just like this, 72 divided by 2 is possible. 36, divided by 2, okay, that's 18. Divided by 2, again, oh, so now this time, that's right, 3. So 9 divided by 3 is 3. So then you can write this one like this. 2 to the 3rd power times 3 to the 2nd power. Oh, now you got to add 1 to each exponent right there. That means this is going to be 4 times this is going to be 3. So, which is 12? Oh, the answer is 12. 12 factors. Fantastic!